our volunteers are what make the Red Cross what it is. Um, without them, we wouldn't be able to do what we what we are um, in the communities. Um, they're they're the face of the Red Cross. They're the heartbeat of the Red Cross, and they really are. They make it possible to be able to be present and active in our communities. And fires are the biggest disaster to you and me because it may not be on the newspaper, it may not be on TV, but Mr. Smith's fire is a disaster to him, and so I need to be there for my neighbors. I don't get anything monetarily, but I get hugs. And those are the most wonderful things I ever get from the Red Cross, is hugs. <laughs> I, was, I became a member of the Red Cross uh, because my friend encouraged me to become one with her. I was looking for something to do. And because it's part of my nature to help others, the debt is the perfect, perfect way to get it done. Uh, we respond to um, different kinds of disasters and uh, it's rewarding when you know that you have given of yourself to someone else. And the feeling you get, you can't really explain it. The person has to experience it themselves. When you give yourself to others, you get so much back in return that you just can't explain it. Mm -hmm. So this time of year, the Red Cross is responding to every every disaster that's out there, um, primarily house fires. A lot of, because of the cold weather, people are using alternate sources of heat and that causes fires. Um, so that's always something that we respond to on a daily basis. But we're also preparing. Down here in Mississippi, you know, we have hurricane season and it's not something that we're able to respond to if we're not properly prepared. So we're recruiting our volunteers, we're training our volunteers, we're making sure our supplies are ready to go. Um, we're always um, looking for different ways to increase our donations so that we're able to respond appropriately for the clients after a hurricane or any kind of large-scale disaster um, and making sure that our volunteers and our supplies are ready to go.